Hi everybody, welcome to Shell Lectures. So it's newspaper time for July 4. So we have been given with a news article which has to be read and then we'll know what is the core of the article which is being shown on the screen and then we'll learn the new words and phrases that have been used in this news article which are plenty in number as far as uh, today's news article is concerned. So let me read it first. Left in lurch with ban, TikTok stars stare at a grim future. The best jokes about India banning TikTok were on TikTok, but people not on the popular Chinese app probably wouldn't have got them. The jokes contained not only funny lines, but also music, dance, acting, emojis and a whole lot of wackiness. Thousands of those went viral in the 12 odd hours that the app was functional on Indian smartphones after the government banned it, citing cyber security worries. Scores of users had already uninstalled the app in the name of patriotism since border tensions escalated between India and China earlier this month, but many refused to hit delete. As a popular creator said in her latest video while spinning on her heel, they are making TikTok videos to order us to delete TikTok. No chance. To Sabira Khan, a popular creator known for posting sad videos, this feels like an end. The news has broken me. I've been crying since I heard. I just reached a million followers and it had taken me a lot of hard work through these months of lockdown, said the creator. So now as we have read this news article, let's know what's the core of the article which is being written here. So we all know that the app, nearly 59 Chinese apps have been banned in India, out of which a very popular app is TikTok, which had been used by more than 10 million users all over India. So as it was banned, the TikTok users are like, they are um, being exposed to a very blurry future, a very, uh, they appear to be very grim because um, some people have just gained million followers and they were escalating in their fame but uh, all of a sudden this ban came and uh, their uh, all the efforts which they had taken for this uh, for this success in their career went like uh, it went waste so the words and expressions that we can learn from here is the first thing idiom it's a brilliant idiom left in lurch it's an idiom which means abandon or to leave somebody in a different situation Okay, it's to leave somebody in a different situation, uh, uh, sorry, difficult situation, leave somebody in a difficult situation. So example sentence we can have, he left me in lurch and I had to finish the whole project by myself. So as he left me in lurch, that is as he abandoned me or as he left me alone in such kind of a difficult situation, I had to finish my project all alone by myself. And then the next word which we can see here is grim, which means a bleak or a miserable one or a blurry one. Okay, what is going to happen? We don't even know how miserable our future is going to be. So that is what is the meaning of the word grim. And we can have an example sentence. His face was quite grim when he informed us about the accident. So he looked some um, kind of a miserable he looked some kind of miserable when he informed us about the accident. That can be told as his face was quite grim when he informed us about the accident. Also, we have wackiness here, which means funny in an odd way. Okay, so what they mean to say is that all the TikTok videos which were posted after um, so, so as to provoke the users to stop using TikTok were not only the... Uh, um, having the funny lines but also music dance and a lot of other funny things in an odd and peculiar manner so that's what is wackiness and then we have odd hours which means unusual hours for example people call us during midnight okay our close friends may call us during midnight so that's what is known as odd hours example we can say my friend usually calls me at odd hours okay uh, for example thing um, like the time uh, when we don't think that a particular incident will happen but the incident has actually happened so those hours are known as odd hours and then we have citing which means quoting or mentioning for example she was cited for reckless driving reckless means rash or careless 
very hasty driving okay so she was cited for reckless driving so it means quoting or mentioning that is uh, mentioning something so she is mentioned for reckless driving and then we have scores of users it's nothing but a lot of users the meaning of the word the meaning of the phrase scores of users is a lot of users so we can say scores of people were found in the market yesterday so a lot of people were found in the market yesterday and then we have the word escalated which means increased rapidly or fastened okay example we can say the petrol prices in india the price of petrol in india has escalated that is it has risen up or it has increased rapidly and then we have certain um and then we have a very important idiom which is being used here that is spinning on her heel that is nothing but we have ta we are talking about a person a tiktok user who uh, in her last latest video a very recent video just before tiktok was banned her video said that uh, they are making tiktok videos to make us delete tiktok no chance so she was just spinning on her heel that's nothing but she was just about to get away or she was about to leave tiktok but its actual meaning is turn away quickly okay but here we can have the meaning like it's just she is turning away from tiktok or she is just moving away from tiktok so that's what then we have some kind of expressions that have been used here three expressions which are um, highlighted in green color not only but also it's a conjunction correlative conjunction which has been used here so i am not only a dancer but also a singer i am a dancer and a singer this compared to i am not only a dancer but also a singer the second one is comparatively better it sounds good right and then we have um, went viral that is thousands of those went viral that is um, their uh, videos reached people more fast and their videos reached people really well that is what the word means and then um, just reached a million followers that's nothing but just now just before tiktok was banned i reached a million followers and then it had taken me a lot of hard work instead of saying i took a lot of hard work or i underwent a lot of hard work you can rather say i had taken it had taken me a lot of hard work through these months of lockdown okay so that's it for today i hope you would have learned something from this news article subscribe to my channel if you have not done so far like and share this video to whomever you know thank you